Hello everyone. Today we will learn an important question from chapter number 5, Linear Equations. Exercise 5.10, question number 3. So, it is given that a total of rupees 50,000 is to be distributed among 200 persons as prices. A price is either rupees 500 or rupees 100. Find the number of each type of prices. So, this is what the question. So, we are going to imagine, we are going to visualize the given scenario in two categories. First is according to the number of persons. Since it is given that rupees 50,000 is distributed to 200 persons and the price worth is with two types, obviously one set of people will get the price type worth rupees 500. Obviously, the uh, another set of people will get the price type worth rupees 100 isn't it so let's uh, frame the quest equation here we have two set of people since we have uh, since the number of persons of both the types are unknown we will assign them as x and y and it is given that the sum of the people is equal to 200 now let's see the second category according to the amount distribution since it is given that rupees 50,000 is distributed to two set of people we don't know how many persons have received the price type worth rupees 500 and also we don't know how many persons have received the price type worth rupees 100 so we can write like this that is 500 into number of persons plus 100 into number of persons that is the another set of people. So, it is equal to rupees 50,000. It is very simple. That is, 50,000 rupees is distributed in such a way. One set of people getting fi uh, 500 rupees price and the another set of people are getting 100 rupees. So, rupees 50,000 is distributed in this way. That is it. So, for our exam, let's see how you are going to write it in your exam. So, according to the number of persons, we are going to assign it as x and we are going to assign the another, num another set of persons as y. That's it. So, let the number of persons getting rupees 500 be x. Let the number of persons getting rupees 500, that is the price, price type worth rupees 100 is equal to y. And uh, the second category is according to the amount distribution, right? The amount distributed for the price type worth rupees 500 is equal to rupees 500 into x. And the pri price distributed for the price type worth rupees 100 is rupees 500 into y. So, according to the question, according to the scenario, we are going to write it here as x plus y is equal to 200. It, this equation is made according to the number of persons and the second category is made according to the amount distribution so 500x plus 100 into y is equal to 50,000 so in this equation both these equation are a linear equation in two variables right we have uh, x variable as well as we have y variable and it is in the form of linear equation uh, if you uh, notice this equation, you can find out that 100 is a common factor in this equation. So, when you simplify, when you divide 100 in this equation, you will get it as 5x plus y is equal to 500. Very simple. You are going to divide 100 uh, in this equation. 500 divided by 100 is 5. And 100 divided by 100 is 1. So, 1y can be written as y is equal to 50,000 divided by 100 is equal to 500. Very simple, right? So, here equation number 1 can be rewritten as y is equal to 200 minus x. That is, uh, in the left hand side, x is there. When it goes to the right hand side, it becomes 200 minus x, right? So, y is equal to 200 minus x. So, by using first equation, we are going to 
substitute in equation number 2 and you are going to get like this that is 5x in the place of y we are going to replace it by 200 minus x is equal to 500 then when you simplify this 5x minus x since they are like terms we can subtract it so 5x minus x is equal to 4x and in the right hand side when 200 goes to right hand side it becomes 500 minus 200 so what happens in the next step 500 minus 200 is equal to 300 and if you want to find out the value of x when 4 goes to right hand side it becomes division because it is in terms of multiplication right so when it goes to the right hand side it becomes division and when you simplify how many 4's are there in 300 you will have uh, 75 4's are there right so we got the value of x when you substitute x is equal to 75 in equation 1 we found it right according to the number of persons we have assigned it as x plus y is equal to 200 so in the equation 1 when you substitute x is equal to 75 and in the next step when 75 goes to right hand side it becomes 200 minus 75 when you simplify this you will get y is equal to 125 so we got the answer so number of prices of type worth rupees 500 is equal to 75 this is what we have assigned it right so x uh, is equal to 75 and number of price of type worth rupees 100 is equal to 125 even when you replace this question replace this answer in the given equation you will get the answer as 200 even when you replace the value of x here according to the uh, price distribution amount distribution so even if, when you replace it over here you will get the answer as rupees 50000 so thank you that's it